Welcome to the World Herald News for the 11th of September 2024. Holy Spirit, show us what we need to hear in spiritual news today. Eight of Pentacles. Work, work. Somebody's working by themselves. Queen of Swords, they're saying something. Six of Cups. They're talking about a past person. Could be a fire sign from their past. The Gate 20. They ended a relationship with this person. Eight of Swords. This was a karmic of theirs. Three of Cups. A karmic friend, possibly. So, a female is talking about the karmic friend of theirs. Four of Pentacles. 84. Somebody could be born in 1984. Could be an Earth sign. Seven of Cups. The 13th of November could be significant that Scorpio season, Scorpio and Libra. The High Priestess, Pisces. The Tower, Aquarius and the Chariot. Look at all these major arcana. So somebody could be talking about their whole history with a particular karmic friend. They could be talking about this in therapy, possibly, or they're publicly talking about it. Ten of Pentacles. Somebody could be making money off of talking about this past person or past people. The Hermit could be a Virgo. Five of Wands. Somebody could be mad that this person is talking about their karmic friends or family, exes, etc. The Wheel of Fortune, 10. Something could have happened yesterday on the 10th of September. Two of Wands. Somebody could have traveled somewhere yesterday. Ace of Wands, 21. Something is over. A cycle is over. King of Pentacles. Again, there's a male earth sign here. Eight of Cups reversed. He wants to return. 83. Something about the year 1983 could be significant. We had 84, now 83. So somebody who's born in 84 wants to return to somebody who's born in 83. Knight of Cups. Uh-oh. So this earth sign wants to leave a fire sign who's a karmic to them. Yes, Leo, you're the karmic. There you go. And uh, he wants to return to a person from their past who could be a water sign. Ace of Pentacles. He wants a new beginning with this uh, water sign from his past, possibly. Yes, King of Swords is true. The Emperor and Temperance. He wants a relationship with somebody from their past. He's leaving a current partner possibly or an ex and going towards an ex from further down in the past, I guess. The Devil, 15. And the lover, six. So one relationship is karmic. This Virgo is realizing that the relationship with the Leo here was karmic. And a relationship with somebody from the past was actually high vibrational. So they want to return to that person. Page of Cups, yes. This Virgo energy, this is a man most likely. He wants to make a love offer. To somebody they've known when they were very young. Three of Pentacles. The lovers, yes. A past lover. He wants to go back to a past lover. He could be traveling towards this lover. Two of Pentacles. Uh-oh. Juggling. Somebody's juggling. So he could be cheating on someone with a past lover. Nine of Swords. Anxiety. Sixty-nine. 
again with the number 69 somebody might like this position with the lovers in 69 here or somebody 69 or born in 69 the 15th of september is in virgo season queen of cups okay so there's a water sign from the past of this virgo male five of cups he's sorry that he left her 35 or 53 could be significant the water sign could be 35 or 53, however this goes. Or born in 53. Yes. The hangman, 12. Could be a Pisces specifically. So there's a man here who wants to leave their karmic partner to be with someone from the past who they are realizing is actually a divine partner. The star, they want healing with this person. Two of cups, they want to heal this high vibrational relationship. But first, they need to drop something with the Ten of Wands here. They need to drop the fire sign. There could be multiple fire sign females who are very angry at this time because I keep picking up this energy, this Queen of Wands energy. Multiple fire sign females are being dumped because the men they were with are realizing this is the karmic. And they're going towards either a water sign or an earth sign instead. So they had a lot of fun with the Queen of Wands, but now they realize she's not good for marriage. So they're going back to the Queen of Cups, Knight of Pentacles, yeah, to make an offer. Temperance, 14. Somebody could be a Sagittarius here. King of Wands, yes. There's a fire sign. Could be a fire sign male who's leaving a fire sign female too. So one of these men is Leo, another one is Virgo, I almost said Libra, so there could be a Libra too. King of Cups could be a water sign too, Seven of Cups. There are multiple men who are fantasizing about people from their past. They're realizing these people from their distant past were their true counterparts or whatever they are. Nine of Cups, Wish Fulfillment, yeah. Two of Swords, but there's a blockage. Possibly because some of these people are still in relationships. Four of Wands. Yeah, some of these people could be married with a Four of Wands. That's the blockage, the fact that they're married. Oops. Knight of Swords. Nine of Wands. The Wounded Warrior. Somebody could be in the military, doesn't have to be. But they've had enough of this person, possibly. Five of Swords. This woman's narcissistic. The fire sign's narcissistic. The fire sign female's narcissistic. That's why these men want to leave her. Knight of Wands, the Emperor. Yeah, exactly. Some of these men are fire signs too. Somebody's a player and they're very controlling. It could be this female. There's a stark difference between this energy and this energy, the Pisces energy is very soft, feminine. This is a more masculine energy, this Queen of Wands. They're hot, they are fun, but they're not good for commitment. Like the Queen of Cups hangman energy is. Exactly, the lovers, number six. Again, this is a past lover. These men are realizing that the past lover is truly their counterpart. Yeah. Pisces again with the moon and the magician the 18th of January Capricorn season could be significant an earth sign could be significant here seven of wands so these men are either fire signs or earth signs possibly water signs too and I said Libra all of them are leaving a very hot female here for somebody who's not that hot the Empress they realized who their empress is, who the divine feminine is. They left the divine feminine behind. 25, somebody could be 25 or they've known each other for 25 years. Or they're born on the 25th. The chariot, 37, somebody could be 37. They're in a hurry. So these men are in a hurry to go towards their empresses. Page of Swords, they're watching the Empress. 
and they want to get together with her again. Ten of Wands, but they want to drop the fire sign first and to run. Drop the fire sign and run like a hot potato, basically. And the lovers was on the bottom of the deck. So yes, they want to reunite with the lover. They're about to break the heart of the Queen of Wands here because they keep fantasizing about the past person who was truly their counterpart. They're realizing that was their true counterpart. The lovers again, yes, they want a reunion. This also makes me think of the Three of Cups reunion energy. The 14th of June could be significant. Somebody could be a Gemini. Gemini Sagittarius. Ace of Pentacles, the world. Something is over. This man wants to end it with the Queen of Wands and start new with the past person. Six is the past. That's what I'm getting here. King of Pentacles again. One of these men is definitely an earth sign. Or some of these men are earth signs. There we go. Anything else? Three of Wands, Six of Pentacles. Ten of Cups, the Hierophant. Okay, so these men want to leave this person and get married. They want to do this in a hurry. They're in a hurry to do this. Ten of Cups because they want their happiness. They want marriage. Wow. They truly see somebody as their happiness with the sun here. The year 2019 could be significant. This could be an ex from 2019, possibly, the fool. Or something's been happening since 2019. Somebody could have married in 2019, and now they want to divorce, etc. <sighs> Five of swords. Four of swords. 45 or 54 could be significant. Again with the 54-year-old. One of these fire sign females is 54. Somebody could be born in 54, however this goes. Somebody could live at number 54. Five of Wands, another five, 55. The lover, six. There are some people in their 50s here who resonate with this. They could even be born in the 50s, depends. Four of Cups and the star. Somebody feels rejected. They feel like they're not the main character anymore. They wanted to be the star. They wanted to stand out more. Again, if this is a fire sign, this could be somebody who's very attractive, who gets a lot of attention, who is the center of attention. All the men want to be with her, but she's not good for commitment. Usually the Queen of Wands is not good for long-term commitment. And it's over with the world here. Page of Pentacles. Somebody's going towards a person who's more down to earth, I guess. 